Some students dream big. Uh, they write for very large ensembles, which we can't really get together for a concert like this, but some pieces are still worth showcasing. Liam Handley dreamed big, and he wrote for an orchestral setting. Liam was going to um, come uh, to be uh, here today, and I was going to have a, a chat to him. Just found out that he couldn't make it just before, but he has written some stuff, and I'll just go through a few things. Um, he says that uh, as part of, part of his inspiration was that for the longest time he'd had a concept for a TV show uh, and he never really acted on it, but since he needed something to do um, and base some musical motives on in this piece, he decided to bring it out and dust it off a bit. Uh, and he says that his piece uses two main motives, one for a protagonist and one for the Greylands, an area themselves. I attempted to tell the story through the progression of the piece, from the protagonist's arrival and discovery of the Greylands, the friends he makes along the way, and his ultimate sacrifice at the end, where he and the lands become one. So listening out for two specific motives, and he's writing for orchestra, which he says was a logical choice uh, because it fitted into the fantasy genre. Uh, which he had a lot of experience uh, with. But he also threw in some electric guitars and a bass and some synths and pads as well. So, well, the, the, and the best line that I think he wrote was, what was your process in writing it? And he said, it's a combination of mucking around at the piano and computer while also listening to an inordinate, inordinate amount of other pieces for inspiration. Let's have a listen to this piece Liam Handley's Sweet for the Greylands.
That was Liam Handley's Suite for the Greylands. <laughs> 